uh, the DJ work started to pick up. Mm. So, you know, first time I came to America, I think it was 97, 98. Yeah. I never forget my first American experience. Like I actually got brought over. The first guy that brought me to America was a guy from Nashville called MK2, Mike okay. Kelly. And they flew me into Atlanta the day before to play a show in Atlanta. Mm. And uh, I came over. Fuck, I didn't realize I was flying straight into the middle of Freaknik. <laughs> <laughs> that, that was like my first experience was, of America. Say something about Jason, Rob. This motherfucker Jason Cambridge, aka A Side. You know, he he can't stay out of LA for some reason. He's just like he might as well get an apartment because you know he moved here. I don't know how many years ago. Yes. But that was my first experience of 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 America, straight into freak now. This, oh, this look at this. The... Fruity girls everywhere, and cars bouncing around. I think he just goes to stay other places and comes back to LA because he really lives here. He just doesn't tell us that. I told him that the other day. Look at him. Rudy's flying. Look at him. Come on, Jason. When I got into America, I, I was surprised. It surprised me first time I came here. Mm. Like, how much people were into it. Mm -hmm. okay. You know? Yeah. And, you know, because you don't see it when you're in the UK. You don't see what's going on in America. Right, right, right. Yeah, especially not in those days. I mean, we never really had, uh, you know, internet was just first kicking off, you know? Yeah. <laughs> Everyone was on a fucking dial-up connection. There was no broadband or anything like that. Well, I didn't switch off. There was no YouTube, you know? Yeah, no YouTube. No iTunes. Yeah, no. Um, it, it was all different back in those days. Mm -hmm. But, I, I mean, when I came over, I got treated really well. You know, the people were, were into it. You know, a lot of them already had all my records, and I was like, fuck, you know. Mm -hmm. They were still buying vinyl hardcore in those days. So it was a more reform, a more informed response. Yeah, I, I mean, I was, I, was, I was surprised. I was overwhelmed mm -hmm. to, to see, like, you know, that people were into it like that. Right, right here. Jason, that's what I'm saying. Jason, what is you know him. But you know, I, I've, I've always, I've never stopped coming ever since. Yeah. Always get here like two to three, two, three, four times a year. Yeah. Come on, A size. What you looking at? Skyscrapers. Skyscrapers. I love skylines. We love skylines. I do. Yes. So you thinking of a, thinking of a beat right now to it? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>